Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you how to show and hide div element after few seconds using AngularJS. See, after four seconds, the div element has gone, and after three seconds, again the div is back on the browser. That's it. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. I am using Notepad++ for this video tutorial. Notice in this Notepad++, just for the time saving, I have written a small HTML code with some header tags h1, h2 and a horizontal line. Now after the horizontal line, I am adding a div element, I am closing this div tag. Inside this div, I am adding some text. Show hide div h1 now before adding the angular.js functionality to show and hide this div element let's save this file we'll check the basic output how it looks the designing path on the browser and this is the output of that code which contains at this moment the header tags and the div element show and hide div now my aim is Using AngularJS, I want to show and hide this div element after a few seconds. So when we are implementing AngularJS, the first thing we require the latest AngularJS CDN link. Let's grab that one. Search for AngularJS latest CDN. Enter. And from the search results, I'm selecting the Angular.js. Angular.js, this website is the official website to get the latest CDN links. You can find the Angular.js, Angular, Angular 2 and Angular.js CDN links. The version I am selecting 1.77. Come to the bottom, I require uh, this one, Angular.min.js. So let's copy this one and add in our HTML header section. Script. I am closing the script tag. Inside the script, source is equals to, I am adding the CDN link. This is equals to, the next I am adding another script tab to add the functionality hide and show. Variable app is equals to angular dot module between double quotes. I am adding the angular application name which I am adding in this do tag ng-app is equals to my app let's copy this one paste here when I added ng-app in this do tag what are the elements we are placing in this do container it belongs to the angular application my app after that Let's add the angular controller also. App dot controller is a function between double quotes. In the same view, I'm adding the another directory which is ng controller is equals to the controller name is my controller. Let's copy this one and paste in the controller function comma function dollar scope comma and the second parameter I am adding the time out service now in this controller function I am adding dollar time out function And this function I'm adding dollar scope dot do show is equals to true semicolon. Let's copy this element do show. In the do element, I'm adding the direct to ng hide is equals to do show. 
the second parameter after the curly braces comma I'm adding the the delay 4000 milliseconds uh, here the condition I have given after 4000 milliseconds which means after 4 seconds I want to hide this due tag so let's save this file we'll check the output on the browser I'm reloading the browser See, after 4 seconds, the due tag has hide. Now the second part, after few seconds, I want to show the due tag. So let's write the functionality. Instead of writing the same code, I'm pasting here. Instead of true, I'm adding false. I'm changing the interval period, adding 7 seconds. Let's save this file. When page loads, after 4 seconds, this due tag will be hired after 3 seconds. So 4 plus 3 is 7. After 3 seconds, I want to show this due tag. Let's add some style to this due. Style is equals to background color is red. Let's save this file. We'll check the final output. I'm reloading the browser. See after 4 seconds the do element has gone and after 3 seconds again the do is back on the browser. That's it.